Hey my beauties, welcome back to my channel. So today I am partnering up with Bobbi Brown to bring you guys this look. So I will be talking to you guys more about their new foundation and a few other products, but this is the look that I will be showing you guys how to recreate. It is so easy. It's actually one of my go-to favorites because you don't really have to put a lot of thought into it. You could wear it for any occasion. It's a neutral matte glam look. So I really hope that you guys love it. If you're a beginner, you're gonna definitely love this look because you don't need real skills for this, you know? So I got you all, so I hope that you guys love this look, but if you guys are new to my channel, hi, I'm Jasmine, welcome to the channel, but I want to invite you to be part of our family. So if you guys wanna be part of the Birdie family, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. And not only if you're new, but if you've been around and you still haven't hit that ring wheel notification, don't forget to hit it. That way you can be updated with all my future videos. But with that, my loves, if you guys want to know how to recreate this makeup look and also learn a little bit more about the new foundation from Bobbi Brown, then just keep on watching. So we're going to start out with our face first. And the first thing that I'm going to use is this Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. This is so amazing. I've already used it on my face a couple times and I absolutely love it. So I'm going to be applying a little bit of this all over my entire face. This is actually a Bobbi Brown bestseller. This is a primer plus a moisturizer. It's rich in feel, but it doesn't feel greasy at all. And this is an oil-free formula. Um, it has shea butter and it also has lots of vitamins like vitamin B, C, and E. It has grapefruit. I mean, it just has it all for you. So now we're gonna apply our foundation and this is the Bobbi Brown Skin Long Wearing Weightless Foundation. It has an SPF of 15. What it claims on the bottle is that it has a full cover and it's oil-free shine control. So it's gonna give you like a matte finish. And I am using the shade Warm Beige, which is 3.5. So we're gonna go ahead and apply this with our Bobbi Brown brush. This is their full coverage face brush and it's meant to be used with liquid and powder foundation. So you can definitely you know, if you wanna use a powder foundation, you can also use this brush for that. The cool thing about this foundation is that it comes in 30 different shades. So you guys know, you guys will definitely find your foundation shade. And also, this is a high performance formula. So, what that means is tested for sweat, water, and humidity resistant, which is so cool. So, if you guys are always sweating or in the gym, this is a great foundation to wear for every day. It also contains vitamins E and C and shea butter to infuse the skin with a healthy hydration. So, even though it's matte, it's gonna be feeling really nice on the skin. It retails for $46 and it's already available at Sephora or on Bobbi Brown's cosmetics website. But that's not only the cool part about this foundation. This is actually supposed to look super natural. It's supposed to be like a multi-dimensional mattifying coverage that is super breathable and weightless. So that's exactly how it feels on the skin and it feels so nice. So I actually love the way that this foundation feels on the skin. All right, so now that we're done applying the foundation, now we're gonna move on to our concealer. So the, the concealer that I'm gonna be using is this one from Too Faced. This is called the Born This Way, and I'm using the shade Light Medium. Once we are done applying our concealer, now I'm gonna go ahead and take my Peach Perfect uh, Mattifying Loose Powder from Too Faced and apply this all over my entire skin. All right, now we're gonna give a little bit of color to our skin. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my MAC Dark Golden Mineralized Skin Finish, and I'm gonna go ahead and just apply this on the sides of my face, just to give a little bit of nice of a bronze. So we're gonna completely skip the blush and move on straight to our highlighter. And our highlighter that we're gonna be using is this one from Bobbi Brown. This is their highlighting powders in the color Moon Glow. It is so freaking gorgeous. I absolutely am dying over this packaging. I love it. But um, this is the highlighter that we're gonna be using, but they also carry it in two different colors. The other color is called Sunset Glow, and the other one is Afternoon Glow, which those two look absolutely stunning. But for this look, I wanna go ahead and use this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this and apply this on the highest points of my face. Oh my God, like I freaking die. It's so pretty. Now moving on to the eyes, I'm gonna be using this palette from Too Faced. This is called the Just Peachy Matte. Since this is a, like a matte neutral eye look that we're going for, we're gonna be taking this palette and it has all the perfect shades for our eye look. So I'm gonna go ahead and first start out with Peach Tea, which is this neutral color right here, and apply this on my crease. We're also gonna concentrate it on the outer part of the eye. 
And you want to blend that out. So now taking the color Peach Cobbler, we're going to start darkening up our crease. So I'm going to go ahead and take a little more dense brush and apply this also on the outer part of the eye. So the way that I'm actually going to apply it is I'm going to place it on one area first. And then after I have all the pigment there in that area on the outer part, I'm going to start blending it up into my crease and a little bit more out. This is going to help us a lot with the blending. So now starting to go a little bit more deeper, now I'm going to take this color right here at the corner. This one is called Peach Tart and also applying it with a smaller brush on the outer part of the eye. And doing the same method, just placing the color and then blending it out. So now taking it just a hint more darker, I'm going to go ahead and use a chocolate dip with a very tiny brush and also apply this on the outer part. Now I'm going to take another brush just to blend it out. Now for my lid color, I'm going to take this neutral, uh, almost white vanilla shade. This is called Peach Meringue. And I'm going to apply this all over my entire lid where we haven't applied any eyeshadow whatsoever. And the way that I'm going to apply it is with just little small touches on the actual lid. Just so we can also start blending it into the browns that we have already applied. Now for my mascara, I'm going to go ahead and take this one from Too Faced. This is called Better Than Sex Mascara and I'm going to apply a few coats of this and then I'm going to apply my falsies. And now for my lipstick, I'm actually going to do a nude lipstick and this is a liquid matte lipstick. This is from Too Faced and it's in the color Child Star. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this on my lips. Alright my love, so that is it for this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget that you guys can check out the Bobbi Brown Foundation in the description box so that you guys can purchase it on Sephora or on the Bobbi Brown Cosmetics website. But with that my loves, if you guys believe that we can and we will make a difference, then don't forget to be part of the family by subscribing so that you guys can join the Birdie family. And also, don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and let me know in the comment section what other makeup looks you guys would like to see and if you guys enjoyed more of these like natural glam looks. So let me know in the the comment section but with that thank you guys so much for watching me today i love you guys and i'll see you guys all in the next video bye yeah. uh no wait, 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 hold on for you know